Jay Blake here with Velo 3D. What's in front of me is a very, very impressive part. This is a copper heat exchanger that was printed on our Sapphire system for our friends over at Launcher for their E2 rocket engine. So this is printed in GRCOP42, which is a NASA developed alloy, which is great for uh, high thermal transfer applications. So essentially what you're seeing in the center here is flow paths for gaseous oxygen that is leaving the pre-burner. And as that gaseous oxygen is leaving the pre-burner, we're routing fuel through the part circumferentially. And as that fuel is routed through the walls of the part, it is evacuating that heat that's being carried by that gaseous oxygen. And as that fuel gets heated, it's being redirected to the injector architecture. And as you deliver that heated fuel to the injector, you're getting a much more efficient combustion process. So what you're looking at here, essentially if you were to take a cross section Z of this part, this is the core of the heat exchanger. So very intricate design. Um, and you would have the gaseous oxygen flowing through these hexagonal flow paths. And then everything around those uh, is actually where the fuel would travel. So this part was actually hot fired at NASA Stennis uh, facility and we're actually going to be sending this back to the test stand to get some more data on it. So a very, very cool real world application for the private sector space industry that was printed on Velo technology.